Hello, my name is Ayana Webb, and today I'm going to be doing a panel cover for you. And in today's video, we're going to do Grenade by Bruno Mars. So as usual, uh, if you're on my YouTube channel, or if you're watching this from Instagram, if you like this video, feel free to like, comment, and share. And if you want more updates, be sure to subscribe. Um, if you're on YouTube or if you're on Instagram, be sure to follow my page. Um, also like my page just to stay updated with some future videos and future tutorials. So today we're going to go over some parts of Grenade, which I will go over pretty much the verse part as well as the chorus. And just for reference, the song is in the key of D minor. For the most part. Um, I'm not going to go too far into the basics of how to name the keys. I do have some previous videos with that which I may show at the end of this video, but for now I'm gonna go right into the tutorial. So for Grenade, I'm going to show you how to do the left hand, then I'll show you how to do the right hand, and I'll show you how to put them together. So the way Grenade works, it actually starts with the first chord being um, the key of D, right? So really, as far as the fingering, you can be as liberal as you want. There's no really strict uh, fingering for this. I'm just gonna show you the fingering that I use and then you can kind of just go from there. So for the part where he goes, um, I'm not quite sure of the lyrics, but I just know the, um, the, uh, the, the chords. So the first bass part, you can use your left hand on D, and just for a reference point, this here is middle C, right? So middle C is the C that's closest to the center of the piano, kind of where my logo is here for the keyboard. This is middle C. My left hand is going to start at the D that is below middle C. And then it's going to move down to A. That's the next part. And it really just kind of just loops back and forth, back and forth, back and forth between D and A. Right? So it just kind of just goes back between those uh, those two bass lines, right? It does change um, further in the song, which I'll get into in a second, right? For the right for the right hand, we're gonna do. Um, so for the right hand, when you when your left hand's at D, right, you're playing the D minor chord for the right hand, and the way you can play it, um, just to make things easy for now. You can place your thumb on A, your third finger on D, and your fifth finger on F to play the first chord. Right? And then the next chord you're going to play, you're going to keep your thumb where A is. You're going to move your third finger down to C and your fifth finger to E. So A, C, E. Right? And you're going to just switch between those two chords. So A, D, F. And then A, C, E. So you play them together, right? So when you add them together, I'm just going over just the verse part, right? As you're playing the uh, D minor chord with the right hand, A, D, F, you're gonna play D with your left hand. And then for the next part, as your left hand is playing A, your right hand's gonna play A, C, E. And then that's how you go, uh, you know, so if I were to sing the song, I'm not gonna sing the lyrics because I don't know the lyrics that well, I just know the chords, right? Right? open. Now there's kind of like an intermittent chord there. Everything stays the same for that chord. A and an A for the right hand. The only note that changes is the middle note for the right hand. So you're gonna move your note from, uh, your note, your finger, your third finger from C to C sharp, which is the black key to the right of C. And then you're gonna keep E where it is. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba, right? So, got your eyes wide open, and then you're gonna shift over. Why were they open? And then gave you all I had and you tossed it in the trash. You tossed it in the trash. You did, right? To give me all your love is all I ever ask. Now for this part, it's going to be different 
um, when he says, uh, cause what, uh, what you don't understand is I had, you know, catch grenade, something like that. So for that part, what you're going to do is the left hand is going to go up to B flat, which is this key right here. And then what's going to happen is your right hand is going to also play B flat with its thumb and your third finger is going to be on D and your fifth finger is going to be on F. You're going to play what's called the B flat major chord. And then you're going to shift everything down a half step, which means you're going to go back to A with your left hand, with your pinky, and your right hand thumb's going to go back to A, and your third finger is going to go back to C sharp, and your fifth finger is going to go back to E. So what that sounds like together is, gave you all I had and you tossed it in the trash, you tossed it in the trash, you did. To give me all your love is all I ever asked, because that's when you do the B flat chords. B flat, B flat, D, F. And then what you don't understand, that's when you go back to that A major chord. A, A, C sharp, E. Right? Then you're going to go into the chorus part. So I'm going to give you the, um, the left hand for that. So again, if you need to, just feel free to break this video up. If it's a little too much at once, feel free to practice the left hand and right hand separately a few times and practice them together and then you can always come back to this video and work on the next part, right? I'm just kind of just going through the entire song in one video, but if it's too fast in terms of just kind of getting all the information, feel free to break the video up if you want to. There's no rush in terms of finishing this video. Is This is just a reference point, right? So. That's the next part where he goes, I catch a grenade for you. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I catch a grenade for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? So for that part, the left hand bass is going to go D, B flat, and you're going to go down to F, or you can go to this F up here. It doesn't really matter which one, but it's B, sorry, D. B flat, F, and then C. So, I catch a grenade for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the chords for the right hand is going to be the bass line for the left hand. So, the right hand, the first chord is D minor, which is basically the same chord as you played at the very beginning. So, it's A, D, F again, right? And then there's that B flat chord that we played before, B flat, D and F, right? Then there's a new chord, which is going to be F major. The way we'll play it is gonna be thumb on A, two on C, and then pinky on F, right? That's gonna be the third chord of that sequence. And then the final chord is going to be G major, sorry, not G major, well, C major. I was thinking of G because G's gonna be at the bottom, right? So the note's gonna be thumb on G, third finger on C, and then pinky on E. And then when you're shifting back, all you have to do is just shift each finger up one note and then you're back to the first chord. So G's gonna, G's gonna go to A, C's gonna go to D, and then E's gonna go to F. When you play them together with the left hand, it's gonna be left hand D, right hand A, D, F, the next chord is going to be B flat major with left hand on B flat, right hand B flat D F. The next chord is going to be F major, which is F for the left hand and A C F for the right hand. And then the last chord is going to be C major with left hand on C, right hand G C E. So I catch a grenade for you. right you know I do sorry do anything for you yeah 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 now for this part it's really just a mixture of the same notes or same chords you already learned in previous parts so I will go through 
is really just the B flat major chord. So left hand B flat, right hand B flat D F. I will go through all of this. And then pain is just the C major chord. So left hand C, right hand G C E, right pain. And then take a bullet is just the F major chord where you're gonna have pinky for left hand on F, and then you're gonna have A C F for the right hand. Take a bullet straight, and then through is just the A major chord, which is left hand A, right hand A, C sharp E, through. And then my brain is just D minor. So left hand D, right hand A, D, F. So if I were to kind of loop that over, I would go through all of this pain, take a bullet straight through my brain, and then you're gonna just kind of step down, right, to C major, which is left hand C, and then right hand G, C, E. Yes, I would. And then we're back to B flat again for die. So B flat, left hand, right hand, B flat, D, F. Die for you, baby. And then the last chord is just A major. So left hand A, right hand A, C sharp, E. But you won't do the same. So that whole part is just, I would go through all of this pain, C major. Take a bullet, F major, straight through A major, my brain, D minor, yes I would, C major, die for you, babe, as B flat major, and then the last chord, A major, but you won't do the same, and then it just kind of loops over to do the same thing. So um, I'm pretty sure that you've gotten a lot of value in this video. If you want to learn more about how you can take your playing to the next level, I encourage you to check out my online piano course for beginners where I go over how to navigate the keys and I teach you also how to play with both hands. And you'll be able to learn how to sight read to the point where you'll be able to pretty much learn virtually any song you want by just putting the music in front of you. I teach you all those basics. I teach you about all the chords you need to learn. I teach you about how to play in different keys. So if you wanna learn more information about that full course, there should be a link in the description box of this video. Or if you're on Instagram, there should be a link in the description box in the main profile page. So thank you for watching and I hope to see you in future videos.